I like rugby because I can play with all my friends. I like everything about rugby. I like, I like passing, scoring tries, tackling people. Because I like getting dirty. Because I like to play with my friends and um, I like to score tries. I like rugby because it's a team sport. Because it's fun and you get to um, get fit in it. Rugby, 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 rugby. Guess what we do. And kia ora. Welcome to another season of the world famous Small Blacks TV. It's me, Nuofi now. I'm back as well and I'm excited. Let me think. Yes, I believe I'm excited. I'm excited about my new t shirt too. It's called a video tee. Shows real videos. Just choose what to play, like this All Blacks game. Boom, bang, what you know about it? There's heaps in today's show, like meet my mate Izzy Dag and Captain Fantastica here with skills and drills, and we meet a very special team of small blacks who are at pre-season camp, and heaps more. I could go on all day, but why don't I show you? We have CJ and Tawira standing by. Roll the tape. <laughs> Konnichiwa, small blacks, and welcome to Meet My Mate. Today's guests, Corey Jane and Tawera Kerbalo. Corey, you consider yourself a good mate? Oh, not a bad one. Tawera, how about yourself? Yeah, not too bad. Well, we're about to see how well you know each other. Corey, mm. how old is Tawera? He's 23. Correct? Wrong. What star sign is Corey? Cancer. I thought you guys said you were mates. No, he just, he doesn't have a clue, mate. Favourite subject at primary school? His one? Yes. Uh, his one was math. History. Going to the movies, would Corey wear track pants or jeans? Um, track pants. Some days I'd wear both, actually. Just jeans like the split trackies? ones. No, just split, I've got a tracksuit pant, jean option. Mm. Yeah, Classy, so have you got any of those? So we'll say he's wrong. No, I'm not, I'm not too up doing the fish. Hamilton don't have that stuff. Here's one. How often does Corey get his hair cut? Pretty sharp today. Mm, once every two weeks. Correct? Um, yeah, about once a month. I'm still waiting for Aaron Smith to do it. Oh, shaves his ears every day, though. <laughs> well, here's our last question. <laughs> Biggest weakness in his game? His one is he kisses up to the coaches too much, <laughs> so they don't actually see him play. <laughs> Correct? I think um, Halfbacks do talk a lot. Sometimes oh. Corey acts too much of a little kid and, and people don't take him seriously, so... <laughs> <laughs> well... You got, that was the first question you got right. So, um, you got a little bit of homework to do, but we'll leave it at that. We're all mates at the end of the day. Small Blacks, we'll catch you next time. Now we salute, so it looks like we're all mates. Oh, so ready? And go. Go, Julian, go! Oh, oh, sorry. Hey, team. Next on the first show of the season is my good mate, Izzy Dag, who's brought along his... blind donkey. Oh, sorry, that's the skill. Heck, I need my eyes tested. Hi, my name's Izzy. Izzy. Izzy Dag. And this is Rugby X Skills with Izzy Dag. First, I'm gonna need some helpers. Kia ora, my name is Anahira. Kia ora, my name is Ecclesiastes. Kia ora, my name is Abraham. Hi, my name is Connor. All right, kids, let's go. OK, kids, this trick is called the blind donkey. So you're going to put the ball behind your back, drop it and kick it over your head and catch it. Now, we all know I can do it. Can you? Come on, then, show me. With the blind donkey skill, you heel flick the ball over your head and catch it. Easy? I'm not sure. It has an official difficulty rating of four. Hold the ball behind your back in two hands and give it a small flick as you drop it. As you drop it, flick your lower leg upward. The ball should strike your heel, now catch it. I used to love going to camps when I was a small black, but I never had a rugby camp. 
Imagine how fun that would be. Shall we find out? My name's Clive Tuffner. Kids call me Tuffy. And this is the pre-season training for the legendary St. McCaws Primary First 15. This is where we lay the platform for another winning season. Winning season. OK, team. Big year coming up. And we want to be on top of the end because we want to be winners. Winners. That's right. Now, it's the last season you'll all be playing together before college, so we're going to have some fun. Fun. Uh, Jonah Toughen Up will be the captain, so let's get behind him. Some people think I'm only the captain because my dad's the coach, but he's way harder on me than anybody else. That's why I'm repeating year eight. Dad says it's good to go out on a win. And uh, Aubrey will be the vice captain. And Audrey, anything to add? Nothing to add. <clears throat> uh, my name is Audrey Goodlass. I am the assistant coach. Um, I'm also Aubrey's mum and personal trainer. I take care of all the details like making sure that there's enough uh, cones, um, strapping tape, um, spare mouth guards, um, making sure that the water bottles are full. I love this game. Right, uh, so you all know each other from last year, but we do have one new face in the team. Um, Fii Kua Puakio. I say that right? Um, yeah, they're straight from Tonga. Uh, anyway, Bulavanaka, welcome, mate. Okay, everyone, let's get up. We're going to run some warm up grids now. Okay, team, I want you to run to the middle, I want you to pass right, and I want you to run left, all right? Okay, got it? Go! Uh, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a passing. There we go, that's right, ball. There's a ball on the air. What's going on? Why is there nobody over here? Pass, 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 pass. Give Thomas a ball. All right, down you go, Thomas. Down. Come on, get down. Bend down, bend down. Keep going, for goodness sake. Okay, what are you doing? The first training was always the hardest, but it's cool running around with all my friends again, like my new Tongan bestie. Oh, I like you too. Okay, not sure Coach Tuffy is on the same page as the world, but he sure does try hard. Another person who tries hard is my man Richie McCaw. 137 All Blacks games and is still the fittest on the park. Here is why. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're all ready to get fit and fast for the rugby season? Yeah. Yep. So first thing we've got to do is uh, get stuck into a warm-up. Can anyone of you tell me how long we should be warming up for? About 15 minutes. That's spot on. So the first thing we're going to do to get warmed up is we want to get our heart rate up and get a bit of a sweat on. So about 50% we'll uh, head for a run, eh? So let's go, eh? This way. Right, how are we feeling? Good? Yeah. Right, now we're going to get into some dynamic stretches, so uh, leg swing. So if we partner up and we just uh, hold each other's shoulder and swing our legs. So get into that. So uh, partner up. Oh, you just go there. Yep, that's it. And swing your legs. That's it. Up and forward. Oh, yep, very good. Nice. So we want our hips facing forward and nice long swings to get the old hamstrings and quads nice and stretched out. Feeling good? Yep. Oh, nice. And swap over, go to the other leg. Yeah, so nice and straight when it goes out in front of you, and then a wee bend as you go behind yourself. Very good, like that. OK, we've got our lower body done, now upper body. So uh, what we want to do is some truck rotation. So we want our legs shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent, so we don't lock them out. And then we'll start low, arms bend a wee bit and twist. So we warm up our core. So you feel like that's going OK, take a little bit of room and just straighten the arms. Do that nice and wide, that's it. Yeah. And now arms up here, and we'll go sideways with the arms up a bit. So the upper body all warmed up now. All right, let's get into it. Let's head over here. Let's go. Hot. Nice work, Tommy. 